Asking a baseball fan to name the greatest bat flip of all time is like asking what the meaning of life is. Its answer is unknown, and people have spent forever trying to get to the bottom of it. The first place your mind goes is probably Jose Bautista's monstrous seventh inning go-ahead home run against the Texas Rangers in the 2015 ALDS. The reaction, the comeback, this moment quite literally defined an entire decade in the 200-year history of baseball. Or maybe you got introduced to the KBO in 2020, and it's baseball culture that encourages bat flips and flashiness at the plate, making MLB look boring. However, the one place your mind likely doesn't go is to Japan. Japanese baseball has always prided itself on respect, sportsmanship, and fairness. The concept of ties is rooted in this culture. Despite this, though, one July night in 1992 was the source of a bat flip so magnificent, so majestic, that it would be a crime to leave it out of these greatest of all time conversations. Tatsunori Hara is an NPB legend. He played 15 seasons, all with the Omiri Giants, and hit 382 home runs and sported a career OPS of 878. Furthermore, he was also a cultural icon in Japan, as his good looks made him a poster boy for all kinds of media in the 1980s. When he finished playing, he took up managing and led the Giants to seven Central League pennants and three Japan Series titles. He also managed the championship-winning 2009 Japan World Baseball Classic team. He retired at the end of the 2023 season and is widely regarded as one of the top managers in Giants history. However, in 1992, he was significantly underperforming his expectations, and the rest of the team followed suit. The situation was so dire that they were nine games out of first place, sitting in fifth by the end of May. Meanwhile, rumors were beginning to circulate that manager Motoshi Fujita would resign, creating a whole other level of problems. The uncertainty surrounding the fate of the most storied franchise in Japan was looking grim, and the players decided that enough was enough. Slowly but surely, the Giants' play and record began improving. They got red hot and began closing the gap. That all led up to this game in July, where a victory against the Yakult Swallows would put them all the way in first place, a crowning achievement considering the position they found themselves in just three months prior. Yet, from the first pitch, all the odds seemed to be against the Giants' favor. Yakult pulled ahead and was looking to shut the door in the face of the Kyojin late in the game. Despite everything, they clawed their way back into the ballgame with a solo shot in the top of the eighth from Hiromoto Okubo, bringing the Swallows' lead down to just two. In the top of the ninth, a walk to Kaoru Okazaki left the aforementioned top to Norihara to step up to the plate with one man on and one man out. Meiji Jingu was fixing to erupt. On a 1-1 count, a pitch that trailed up and in knocked Hara down to the ground. Unsurprisingly, Hara was furious about the situation. Channeling the emotion from the ups and downs of the season up to that point, Hara seized his opportunity on a 3-1 changeup that caught far too much of the plate and blasted a behemoth home run that sailed far into the Tokyo night sky. He sent his bat flying into the Tokyo night sky too. The force of the release, the height it gained, the roar of the crowd, it was a powerful statement. This bat flip willed the Giants' spirits, and they fought with Yakult into extra innings, ultimately leading to a solo shot from Yuji Ono in the top half of the 11th inning, and lockdown pitching from Hiroshi Ishige in the bottom half to close the book on the Swallows that night, 5-4. So how did it turn out for Hara and his Giants teammates that season? Sadly, no Central League pennant and no Japan Series title. So why focus on this if it didn't lead to any noteworthy accomplishments? Because they finished the 130-game season, in second place. Most didn't expect them to finish above last, let alone in contention for the top spot. Looking back on that 1992 season, it's safe to say that this game, and more specifically the bat flip from Harasan, exemplify a tenacity within the Giants' ranks. And for that, this moment is ingrained into baseball history, easily making it the answer to the question we looked at at the beginning of this video. The greatest bat flip of all time.